Rosh Hashanah time is a time when we bring our hearts before God and we, we ask God to settle issues. It don't matter how low you fall, he can devise a way to bring you back. He wants you to come. Sometimes you can't change things. You just got to come. Oh Lord, thy blood was shed for me. And then thou biddest me come to thee. O oh, Lamb of God, I come. Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur is about, it's about to avoid the judgment. Rosh Hashanah is the time he gives us the chance to escape. Some of you have lost marriages and relationships. Business opportunities have been destroyed. He want to redeem your life from that destruction. God has Jesus in between you and every circumstance out of hell that's trying to destroy you. His whole plan is in love to strategize your success, even if you've done things to demise your own self. And we all have. That's what Yom Kippur is. It's God redeeming you from your sins. I'm trying to get you to feel God's heart right now, this day, this hour, this second, on Yom Kippur, what atonement means that God is eager to forgive you. Now you can look every devil in the face and tell him there's no accusation he have on you. Everything is covered under the blood for the next 12 months. Yes, Lord, I hear that. See, you thought you were just repenting for the past. God says when he called you to Rosh Hashanah to repent, you're covering 12 months. You're not to let the devil throw up anything in your face. You're not to let him condemn you about anything. Because the Lord is your righteousness. Jehovah Tiskanu is your righteousness. Yom Kippur is the high holy day and it's God's new year on his calendar. We celebrate New Year's on December 31st, but God celebrates the New Year on Yom Kippur. There'll be a very elegant dinner prepared for you by Apostle Taylor to celebrate Yom Kippur, the New Year on God's calendar. Yom Kippur is also known as the Day of Atonement. It is the day when we come before God with a sacrificial gift an offering of our best. Over the years, people have brought homes, cars, diamonds, gold, or their best sacrificial financial offering. God commands us to come before Him at this time with an offering. There shall be a day of atonement. It shall be a holy convocation unto you, and ye shall offer an offering made by fire unto the Lord. It shall be a statute forever throughout your generations in all your dwellings. Leviticus 23 verses 27 and 31 Come and receive the blessing of God on you and your family for the next 365 days at this year's Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur celebration with David E. Taylor, September 29th through October 9th, 20320 Superior Road, Taylor, Michigan, 48180. Call 1-877-THE-GLORY now. Registrations free. Seats are free.